What's going on, everybody? Super Saiyan Paul here, back at it once again. Today, we're playing some Dragon Ball Z Boost Fury. And, uh, yeah, it's for the Game Boy Advance, one of my favorite Game Boy Advance games ever. And I'm playing it on... Oh, wow, I already started to file. We're going to be playing it on PC, so... Previously in Dragon Ball Z Legacy of Goku 2, we've got... Goku's son, Gohan, was able to tap into his deepest powers and finally destroy the monstrous cell. Oh yeah, that game was awesome too. I should play that. Finally, after years of turmoil caused by Dr. Jiro's androids, the Earth was brought back to normal. Except for one thing. Goku, who was killed in a desperate attempt to defeat Cell, could not be revived by the powers of the Earth's dragon. And despite a clever plan to bring him back to life, Goku decided it'd be safer if he didn't return to Earth. And so, friends and family were forced to say goodbye to the Saiyan that they loved. Budokai 1 endings, though, that one was awesome. Despite this terrible loss, the world was finally at peace. Or was it? Somewhere on planet Earth, something ancient and horrible was sleeping. A terror beyond imagination. And the forces of evil were preparing to awaken it from its primeval imprisonment. <laughs> the cool thing about this game, it uses Bruce, Bruce Falconer's soundtrack, so yeah, it's an official game. And out of all of the Legacy of Goku games, because this is technically Legacy of Goku uh, 3, this one actually performed the worst in terms of sales. I don't think there was that many advertising, and plus since they changed the name to Boo's Fury, you kind of lost the brand name there, even though it is Legacy of Goku 3. So meanwhile, millions of light years above, along the winding track of Snake Way, Goku was adjusting well to life in the other world. Yeah, you didn't have to take care of your kids, you left it up to Piccolo, you asshole. And here we are on Snake Way. Now I forgot how long Snake Way was. Listen, King Kai, can't you run any faster? We're not making very good time. How many times do I have to say this? We can't make... We can't make bad time because it never runs out here in other world. But I can't wait to see this master of other world you told me about. Talk about the ultimate fighting challenge. I have to tell you, Goku. You better not think lightly of him or you're going to be in trouble. Maybe if I explain. <laughs> you know, I am King Kai and I watch over the Earth. And... You're part of space. But the universe is divided into four quadrants. There's the North, East, South, and West quadrants, each with their own King Kai. But further above us is the Grand Kai. He rules above the, over the Kais themselves. And he's also a martial arts master with a planet full of fighters, which is why we have to get there right away. See, how do we get to Grand Kai's planet anyway? You have to take a plane. <laughs> it's Khan, the higher plane. It's docked next to King Yammer's castle at the end of Snake Way. Thanks, King Kai. I don't want to be late, so I'm going to run ahead. See you there. And we are out of here. So, this game was extremely polished, and you guys have no idea how many hours I threw into this game. Um, it has a lot of replay value, actually. So, yeah, this is a very detailed snake way. If you compare this to the first Legacy of Goku, that one was pretty shitty. But Legacy of Goku 2 is good, and this one, it actually was pretty good as well. So, King Yammer. Can I have the next soul, please? Hi, King Yammer. How's it going? Well, what do we have here? Our old friend Goku. Dead again already. Damn, roasted. Straight roasted. Bring that ass right back here, boy. Goku, wait up. Am I gonna have to put a leash on you? Oh, he called you his bitch. King Kai, how did you die? Well, it's a long story. I gotta make this screen wider. Hold on. Eh. Oh, God. I changed something there, but it's what I, whatever. I can barely see the text, alright? So, no time for long stories. We have to get going. Nice seeing you again, King, Ka King Yama. Say, so, where's the higher plane? It's the door to your left. Are you sure you don't want a cup of tea? Yes. And we're out of here. Sir, you can't go in this way. I'm afraid you're going to have to wait in line like... Wait a second. You still have your body. I haven't, haven't worked here long, and you're the first person I've seen who kept their body. Please go ahead. Wow, special treatment right away. Because I'm Goku, and I could key blast you into shit. So here's the badass plane. This is the plane to heaven. The higher plane's on the other dock. God damn it, I'm going to the higher plane. 
Alright, so I'm heading over here. This is it, Goku! The plane gonna take us to Grand Kai's planet! What? How can we get stuck with this clunker of a plane? I really wanted to ride the big fancy one! No homo. Uh... <laughs> Grand Kai's mansion. This is it, Goku! The Grand Kai's planet! Why does he sound like Hartman? <laughs> really? It doesn't look like much! Watch your mouth! Oh, sorry. I guess it is more impressive than your planet. Especially since your planet was blown up by when Cell exploded. Goku, don't remind me. You're a very rude man. So where is this Grand Kai? I want to. I want to see him fight. To tell you the truth, Goku, in all these years, not even I have had the privilege of seeing Grand Kai fight. But it said no words can describe his fighting style. Wow. So when do we meet him? You'll meet him when he's ready to meet you. It's not something to be taken lightly. So why don't you go introduce yourself to one of the other fighters? Maybe learn something. <laughs> oh, and one more thing. Do you see that circle around? It's called safe pad. And we, if you guys know the game, you guys should probably. Oh, it's like a safe pad. And he's just looking at the car. He's like, oh my god. Oh, this one is the one I want. Win condition. Classic chrome detail. Yep. Alright, so we're gonna head over here and save. And down here, we have a bunch of fighters. Greetings, King Kai. It's good to see you. Hello, Olibu. I'd like, to, I'd like you to meet Goku. He's new here. Hey, Olibu. Olibu is from Earth. Just like you, Goku, most of your heroic legends are based off of this guy. He's working on his 10,000 years of training, and he'll be as soon as he's done, he'll be able to work and train with Grand Kai himself. 10,000 years? Does everyone have to train like train that long before they get to train with King Kai? Yo, the text is actually blurry on my screen. Well, yeah. You have to show you're perfectly qualified, or else you'd be wasting the Grand Kai's time. I guess. You should talk to the fighters here, Goku. They might be able to teach you a thing or two. Now, I don't really need to learn anything. Yeah, you guys can dip. Alright, so, with that, first two things I know to pick up right off the start are these two chests. One ton armbands, and then the one ton boots. Now, in the show, we saw Goku training with the stuff, and it was awesome. So, let's equip this. This gives you more EXP, but it slows your character down. Now, um, one of the problems I heard with this game, which wasn't really a bad problem because a lot of people actually like this game, was the fact that it was easy. And there's a reason why, is which I'm about to show you. If we go through here... Hey Goku, up ahead is the Battlefield Royale. It's a grueling maze of strong fighters. It's an incredible fighting challenge. Incredible fighting challenge? I'm so there! Damn, my throat. I admire your enthusiasm. However, many of these fighters have been training for hundreds and even thousands of years. Are you sure you're ready? Yes, this is lightweight work. Yes, I'm gonna go kick some ass, so... You're going down, rookie! Alright, come over here, Joyce! So basically, you can actually just bounce them into the walls and stuff, and they'll actually get trapped. Most enemies can. If you bounce them too uh, fast, they'll actually bounce off. But I just got a, a drop on my first kill file. Uh, what... It was uh, accessories, right? White belts. So this gives me more XP. And um, if you look at the blue bar at the top there, that's my XP, my health, my key, and then my Super Saiyan ability. But I can't use it right now. Alright, so that's instant transmission. I have the Command May Wave and all that. But you're about to see how I can break this game. So from the start, look at all we got here, boys. A newbie! So this is instant transmission. And it wasn't really all that good. Alright, so we get stat points, so you can level up Goku's abilities. Now, every time you level up, you get 3 points, and you can distribute it to Strength, Power, and Endurance. If you just throw this all into Strength, you'll break this game. It's really that easy. You don't really need anything else if you just rely on Strength alone, I'm telling you. I went through this game easy mode because I look at this. I'm going to start breaking these guys up in like 3 punches. And then you're going to be able to Power Train because of this. It's like really... You made this fall. Must be the beginner's luck. Yeah, there's really no point in having to use Key Blast because, uh... I mean, for range attacks purposes, that's it. But look at this. So 62. And if I use this, the fast forward button. Which you're going to want to do to train up. Alright, so... Look at that. I'm just going to power level watch. You want to get to level 65 before anything because you can't go past the gate up there, so... Gotta punch the shit out of these guys. 
And those these soups that drop, these are healing items. So basically, if you're in a very sticky situation, you can use these to heal up at any time. And sensu beads are in this game as well, so they can help you out um, on top of that. Damn, look at this. I can two hit these guys now. So basically, I'm gonna get to the point where I can one hit them, and then basically you're gonna see the EXP bar just fill up for no reason whatsoever. So 65. And it's really that easy. But it's a really, really fun game. If you don't want to break the game, then all you have to do is just distribute the points evenly. Which, if you play this game a lot, I don't really think it's worth it. But, I don't know. See, my key blast attacks take that long to kill them while I just run up and punch. 1-2. One, 1-2. Two. One, two. Didn't have to waste any key. And, uh... Yeah, watch this. 66. And we're good. So my strength is like way overpowered right now. Maybe I'll balance the character out just to show you guys the key blast later on. Most impressive. Aloibu, how did you get here? I took a shortcut. Now are you ready for a real fight? And watch this. He's a boss fight. And I beat him in five hits. Okay, okay, you win. I gave up. Say, I have an idea. Follow me. So I think I'm going to balance it out because that wasn't really the most exciting. This is a character game. The number is the level your character needs to pass the barrier. And that's the character's color, and it has to be Goku because he's orange. You know what? I'm going to make Goku the strength character, and I'll probably make the other characters that you can play as, spoiler alert, uh, balanced. So, this is the Cave of the Asians. It said there's a hidden artifact in here, but nobody's been able to get it. So, we're just going to come my way up this door. And you're going to want to get past this Kachin, so... Great job of blowing the door open, but if I'm not mistaken, this wall is made out of Kachin. It's the strongest metal in the universe. Sure, your Kamehameha Wave is strong, enough, strong, but I don't think it can bust through that wall. So we're gonna... Sorry about that, guys. I have a little bit of cold. It's to transmit right through it and get this cotton E. Or E. Whatever it is. E. Amazing, Goku. I once met a yard rat that used that technique. You are full of surprises. And this is only your first day here. I can't wait to see what the future brings. Hi, Kanye's Bear Fire! Goku's the bear fight! Oh god, wait a press. Hi god! Hold on. Oh. Goku! Hi god! Goku! They're gonna square off. Whoa, look at all the Kai's! Hey King Kai, why did you shout my name? I'm having an argument here with where's Kai. He says he he says his fire PyCon is the best fire in the universe. As you must know. Pycon is the prize fire of the West Quadrant. In fact, just the other day, the Grand Kai called himself to stop an uprising in HFIL. The home for infinite losers. I've been there before when I fell off a snake way. King Yammer sent some evil guy there na named Cell, and he met some guy named Frieza, and they took over the whole place. Cell and Frieza? Pycon was able to take both of them on no problem. I bet Goku could do that. Well, Frieza was no problem, but Cell. Never mind that. Goku is a righteous fighter who saved his side of the galaxy many times. He's an incredibly strong guy. Listen, guys, this is a reunion. No time for an argument. This is the first time all four Kai's have been together in 300 years. He's right, you know. <laughs> Instead of arguing, we should prove which one of us is the best with the martial arts tournament. Did I see? Did I hear someone say tournament? Grand Kai! I think a tournament is a radical idea. And to make things exciting, I'll throw in a free private lesson for whoever brings home the gold. You mean the winner of the tournament gets a free lesson from you? That sure beats training for 10,000 years. The tournament will be held in my house. I'll see everyone there. I'm gonna kill you, by God. Alright, so we have to head inside the house. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you guys like and favorite the video. Subscribe for more. We'll be seeing you guys next time. We're going to be heading inside the house and fighting in the tournament. Peace!